welcome in to Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. This is Michael St. John. I'm joined with the beloved, somewhat, Hot Rod Biggs for this first television taping of Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. And Mr. Biggs, you have held titles before. You're a professional wrestler of great renown, but this is the first time you've stepped behind a microphone. It's going to be a little different as now you get to call the action for the fans somewhat. Well, I'll tell you what, Michael St. John, I've seen you besides some of the best, baby. Lance Russell, all the way down the list. What a privilege it is for you tonight to be standing here next to Hot Rod Biggs for Southern All-Star Wrestling, baby. Well, it's great to hear the fans. They're excited. We're excited because some of the greatest young talent in all of professional wrestling all have of professional come to the wrestling. South all right of here. Now, Mr. Biggs, you're a lot more familiar with a lot of the talent. I know in a few minutes we're going to have the commissioner of Southern All-Star Wrestling join us. But you, I understand, are one of the talent scouts. But i got to say, from what I've just seen of some of the tapes that I've seen of some of these wrestlers, some of the finest young talent are right here right now. You may see them here today, but you may see them on a worldwide stage very, very soon. We're about ready to get underway. Give us some of the talent that we'll be seeing today, Mr. Biggs. Well, I'll tell you what, baby, Southern All-Star Wrestling. Tonight, we got Chris Baum in the house. We got a little bit of Hammerjack in Southern All-Star Wrestling. We got Chase Stevens and Andy Douglas, baby. The Naturals are right here in S. A.W. I'm getting, I mean, you're just, I mean, I've got cold chills. The Naturals have been tag team champions in the N.W.A. Four, three, times. three times on their way to a fourth. They are here in Southern All-Star Wrestling. I got news for you. They're not coming here just to mess around. They're here with a purpose. That's right, baby. Only the best coming to you from S.A.W. Wrestling. Michael St. John, I think these fans are ready to see some action, baby. Let's get it on up and coming in the world of professional wrestling and we've got an opportunity to see them right here today on Southern All-Star Wrestling. They lock it up, collar and elbow and right away going over to the left arm and uh, using that to his advantage. Well, I tell you what, make no mistake about it, don't just anybody walk into the doors here at SAW, baby. You got to have talent to get through the doors and you see what kind of talent is he's rich in his arm right now, baby, trying to get the best of him. Right now, Adam Armour with the headlock on Harley. Side headlock, Harley may be going into the hair. Referee looking intently. Going to send him across into the ropes. Shoulder block Harley coming down, up. Baby. Adam Armour up and over, Michael St. John. What's going to happen here? Another big shoulder tackle, and he is on fire. And Adam Armour, the man from the Magic City, making things work to his advantage in the early going here in this match. Adam Armour with the shoulder block and then right onto the mat he goes. He, he does a hip toss with the headlock. And right now, Armour in control of this match. 216 pounds out of Birmingham, Alabama. TJ Harley, 212 out of Glen Falls, New York. Well, I tell you what, man, these people, they've been all over the world, Michael St. John. They wrestled for New York. You might have seen these guys on heat. These guys are definitely up and coming superstars in the world of professional wrestling. And what a pleasure it is to have them here in Southern All-Star Wrestling. Great move that time by TJ Harley as he took that head scissors. But now, quickly, Adam Armour regains the advantage and puts the man down. And again, this is an opportunity for a lot of our wrestling fans throughout the Mid-South to see young, outstanding stars come into the squared circle. Maintaining the side headlock. Here's Armour, oh, off with the shoulder block. Beautiful move. What a move, I don't think the fans have seen that one and it definitely worked to his advantage, baby. Staying inside headlock. Well, let's see what he can do with it, Michael. Right now, again, Adam Armour, having control of the match, being put into the corner. Harley gonna put a boot to the midsection, that'll slow things up, oh, what a right hand. Well, I'll tell you what, that's one sure way to stop him, Michael. Four good knuckles across the jaw does it every single time, baby. Well, I know in your past that you have uh, uh, at times relented to that. 
Well, I'll tell you what, you got to do what you got to do. This is professional wrestling, baby. This ain't tennis, and they ain't carrying tennis rackets, baby. He's carrying some boots, and it looks like he's carrying a good whipping on this punk right now. Well, right now, Adam Armour comes firing back, but TJ Harley evening things out with a blow to the throat. You know, we'll have the opportunity to introduce the brand new commissioner of Southern All-Star Wrestling in just a few minutes. And of course, one of the things we've got to look forward to is the crowning of some champions in this uh, division. And that is, of course, the Southern All-Star Wrestling TV champion. And then talk of a new Southern All-Star Wrestling champion to come along the pike as well. Well, you know, absolutely. Everybody's got a fair opportunity. The titles have not been claimed, baby. They're all up for grabs. Everybody, wrestlers from all over the country are trying to get their foot in the door, and everybody in the area is gunning for that title, Michael. These two individuals have as good a shot as any, and right now, T.J. Harley has taken over the momentum in this match. As he, T.J. Harley's having his way with this kid right now. Harley is a tough customer. I'll tell you, I had a chance to look at some film on him. He is a real true up and coming. Back body drop. Oh, sunset flip. Going for it. Will Adam get it? He gets it. Adam Armour with the cover counter two on the sunset flip. And there is the big clothesline. And down goes Adam Armour. You know, Adam Armour was making a very good showing when this match started off. But TJ Harley's got the best of him, and that could have been it, baby. That could have been it right there. This guy has definitely got his sights set on one of these titles coming up right here in SAW Wrestling. And TJ Harley still now with momentum going high, back body drop, and down goes Adam Armour again with a thud. This is a cover, loops the leg, one, two, and that was all he got. Well, you know, I tell you what, this kid's got a lot of heart because I think if any one of these rednecks watching this match, if it was any one of them that just got back body dropped right there, the match would have been over. So that shows you what this kid's made of as he kicks him, ducks the clothesline, and oh! lands with a big spin wheel kick. What a kick! And this time now, back of the neck, down goes TJ Harley. Adam Armour loops it to... Oh, he almost had him. What a pinning combination that time put together by Adam Armour. Well, I tell you what, Adam Armour is definitely making a name for himself. He's made a name for himself all over the United States of America, down in Mexico, Puerto Rico, and now he wants to make a name for himself right here at Southern All-Star Wrestling, and he's doing one hell of a job, if I say so myself, Michael. Belly to back suplex, and Armour now taking the brunt of the onslaught by T.J. Harley. Harley, I think, senses that he's got a chance to win this one. Now look at this. Goes into the full Nelson. Reverse neck breaker. Cover. Two. Three. Bingo. And that's it, baby. Your first winner. Tell me their first winner is right here tonight. Adam Armour out of Birmingham, Alabama, gets the win on Southern All-Star Wrestling. Michael St. John, Hot Rod Biggs will be back with more action after this. Welcome in to Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling, Michael St. John, and I am honored to have the brand new commissioner of Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. This is a man who has a background in promoting wrestling. Here is a man that knows professional wrestling from the inside out because he himself was a professional wrestler. And by decision of the board of directors, and I understand, Freddie, it was a very, very tough decision, but they have entrusted you, Freddie Morton, as the commissioner of Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. Congratulations and welcome in. very much. Michael, let me say this. It's a pleasure to be here. I'm excited about professional wrestling like I haven't been in many, many years since the days of the fabulous Jackie Fargo. I'm proud to be associated with such a great uh, uh, organization as Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. I'm proud that you're a fact and history is going to be made. We've got tomorrow's stars today. That is a very important statement, and I know as a man and knowing your reputation as a promoter, not only in the South, but in the Southwest and the East Coast as well, that you have brought in good young stars every place you've been. That is the goal of this organization. But I do understand that there are a lot of other goals too, and one of the big goals here is to make this fan-friendly. 
That's exactly right. We want to give the fans what they want to see. And I would encourage everyone that's tuning into this broadcast, get on the phone, call somebody, tell them that Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling is on TV and to be watching. We're making history in Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. So pick up that phone, visit our website, tell somebody about Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. This is going to be great, folks, and this is going to be a lot of fun. And with the talent that I've already seen that's on the roster, I mean, it is very, very exciting. But I also understand that in the world of professional wrestling that there's sort of a new trend in that we've seen it in baseball, we've seen it in basketball, we've seen it in football, and that is for the security and the safety of the athlete. And unfortunately, in professional wrestling, and Freddie, I know you know this firsthand, as do I, an awful lot of athletes have seen their careers shortened by some things that just shouldn't be going on in the world of professional wrestling, in my opinion. That's exactly right. I know years ago, Owen Hart almost paralyzed Stone Cold Steve Austin. So as a, an executive decision, the powers that be have decided to outlaw the pile driver. And I stand behind that decision 100% for the safety of the professional wrestlers. They are not only performers, they are athletes, and we're looking out for their best interest. Well, I must say that may or may not be a popular decision, but from the safety standpoint of these athletes, I think it is a very popular decision because, as you well know, and my uh, broadcast partner, Hot Rod Biggs, suffered a neck injury, was out for eight months at one time as the result of a pile driver. That is just something that can go awry, and can the, the, the injuries are devastating from that. So I must commend you on that. No doubt about it. Ultimately, we are a fan-friendly company, but we do have to look out after our professional wrestlers. That is the bottom line, and we are outlawing the pile driver. And one other thing before I let you get away, Commissioner, is the fact that here in Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling, the fans demand champions. They want to see champions compete, and I know up and coming here on the future programs that we're going to have the opportunity to firsthand name champions right here in Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling. That's exactly right. And later on in today's broadcast, we'll be showing the belt that we are uh, going to be debuting here for this, this program. And uh, we'll give a little bit more information about that here in just a short bit. Ladies and gentlemen, we're proud to announce and proud to have the first interview with the new commissioner of Southern All-Star Championship Wrestling, Mr. Freddie Martin. Welcome aboard. Looking forward to working with you. It's a pleasure. We're going to take a break. More wrestling action coming your way.